Welcome to the Friday final. Good to have you aboard. We've got a loaded show tonight with a primer on Charlie Cole's day in Miami tomorrow. UC and Xavier also have one more important game each before squaring off next week. But we'll start with Ohio High School Hoops at Franklin High tonight where Luke Kennard got a send off worth being the state's Mr. Basketball. The senior night game itself, Franklin hosting Eaton as you know, Luke's teammates get it. Head of the field, Luke slams down two of his 39 points. Kennard gets it too, only as good as your teammates. Look at this nice no-look pass for the easy layup. Then this happened. In a 51-point game, the rebound comes to Kennard, takes it himself, and then it's oh, up, up, and away. He's going to Duke. I figure he'd get ready for the Vital stuff. He's got the shooting stroke too. Can't be Mr. Basketball without that. Nice little lefty shot there. 104-53, the final score. Franklin with a 51-point win on Luke Kennard's senior night. Wow, I'm not going to answer that question, man. Get beat, we, we come up with a brilliant effort. Wow, how things change. Before the game, all I heard was, boy, this and that. You know, they start playing. They're, they're, they're the big blue. You ought to know that. I'm not mad at you, but I, I, where, where have you been? And where are you from, sir? You're from Lexington. Oh, my Lord. The late, great Miami coach Charlie Coles following a 2009 loss to fifth rank Kentucky. That was voted the best Coles moment on the school's website. Tomorrow, the university will celebrate his career on the Miami campus as a player by retiring his number 10 to the Rafters, the sixth such honor for a Red Hawk men's basketball player. As the coach, he won 266 games in Oxford, taking Miami to three NCAA tournaments, including a Sweet 16 appearance. Xavier is also in action tomorrow at the 12:30 tip at Cintas against St. John's. First of two games in nine days against the Red Storm, in which Chris Mack believes has the most talent of anyone they've played. And their guard, D'Angelo Harrison, is on fire of late with games of 21 and 33 points in the Johnny's last two outings. You know, he's one of the best guards uh, in the country. Um, he really plays with great pace. You know, it starts off with uh, his jump shot, which is flawless. He has great, great balance. Uh, he gets to the free throw line an awful lot. He doesn't press. The game comes easy for him. And, you know, he's just a, he's just a huge matchup. You can't lose him on the floor. They'll tip at 12:30. Bearcats also at home for Tulane, needing this one after a midweek loss at Temple. Owls needed the game and played like it, scoring 75 points on a UC defense, which hadn't allowed 70 points to an opponent in 27 straight regular season games. Only a few games remain now. Cats cannot concern themselves with anything but winning as many of these as possible. We can't worry about. To Lane and what happened to them before any of that, we're fighting for our lives right now. Our guys got to understand, okay? I mean, we're, it's on us to put ourselves in or out of the tournament. We control it. If we win games that we should win, we'll be in the tournament. If we don't come to play, okay, it doesn't matter if Tulane comes to play. We got to come to play. Busy day tomorrow. In addition to the X and UC home games, Ohio State heads to East Lansing to play Michigan State. Mark Loving back for the Buckeyes after serving a two-game suspension. NKU will host Stetson at the bank, top-ranked UK, back in Lexington after surviving that trip to Baton Rouge earlier this week. And, of course, Charlie Cole's day at Miami begins at 3.30. High school hoops tonight from the Greater Miami Conference. Sycamore hosting Colerain early on. Colerain's Jalen Spears, quick first step, soft touch. Aves now doing it with defense, and it's another Jalen. Shropshire, the steal, and it'll show the ball. Off the window for two. Shropshire in transition now. Look at this pass. Nick Gerlich with the easy deuce. Coach Moss and the Aves go on for the win tonight. 52-47 tonight's final. 